Hello and welcome to the August Adopt a Dolphin e-update. I'm Charlie Phillips. This month started off really nicely with lovely Rainbow being right in front of my camera catching salmon and having a great time. She was leaping about and showing her young son Indigo how it's done, so he joined in with some nice socialising of his own. The very next day there was not a dolphin to be seen anywhere near Channery Point, but there was a much bigger visitor in the area. A beautiful fin whale, the second largest whale on earth, and he or she cruised in and out of the area very quietly and thankfully went safely back out to sea again after about four hours or so. Spirit has been seen a few times and I caught up with her myself while out in a survey with Aberdeen University. Her dorsal fin is in the middle of the picture with her two-year-old calf behind her and one of the males called Legion is surfacing to breathe right in front of her. They were heading east towards Nairn in the by now choppy water and were travelling fairly quickly, so we left them to it and turned the boat around and headed back to Cromarty. No sign yet of moonlight seen here in an archive photo with Cromarty Lighthouse in the background. I still think that she's in the group of dolphins seen off the coast of Holland this year, as there were some of her old friends like Chewbacca and Tolfin seen with mischief in more of the photos that were sent by the Dutch scientists. It'll be a waiting game to see if and when they arrive back in these waters. Keslet's a mystery too, no sign of her anywhere. But her son Charlie is here, there and everywhere, getting literally into scrapes as his dorsal fin shows. A big white abrasion mark there, and that's not a mark made by another dolphin, so we must have rubbed up against something. Finally this month, the story of young Spurtle, who is still holidaying in Ireland, continues, with a few new photos coming our way, and we've been able to identify some more dolphins that she is with, like her mum Porridge, with Spurtle's three-year-old brother or sister seen in this picture, and we've recognised a few more well-known dolphins to us, like young Doyle, with her year-old youngster, and a six-year-old pal of hers called Forth, who is the offspring of Echo, and actually the fourth generation of dolphin born up here. Well, that's all from me this month. Until next time, thanks for your support, and bye for now.